Hi again, everybody. Welcome back to the Mac Center, where the Golden Flashes break their modest three-game losing streak. I'm Ty Linder. KSU Northern Illinois, the only matchup this year in the regular season to the highlights. Trolled by Edwin, back to Jimmy, thought about shooting from the elbow. Penetrates instead and drives and scores. Left hand to send the Golden Flashes in flight on this Tuesday night. Kellen to the line, down the lane, flip it up blindly from the block. No, Hall the rebound, the putback. Great job. With 1350, Hall turning to his right. Good pass, got it to Davis, and that's part of Jimmy Hall's game. That ripped in the middle, Edwin on the run back. Orris wrapped him up, that shot is good. It will count. Hands it off to Dion Edwin. Can state the ball on a two point lead. Edwin lost the defender. He missed on the baseline right just long. Pokes the ball away into the hands of Ortiz. Edwin never gives up on a play. Lob to Beiser. He missed the dunk. Edwin put it up and in. Northern Illinois had a 28-26 lead at halftime as both teams really struggled offensively in the first half. But once the second half began, Kent State went on a 9-1 run to start the second period and really didn't look back until very, very late. Jimmy Hall, foul line extended to Jalal Cancer. He wants the lead. He's got the lead. Just wanted to prove you wrong, Ty. They can do more than Ty. <laughs> Flashes have stopped NIU twice to start it. Thomas down the lane, cuts through it, throws it back outside. Head fake on a three. Edwin now will drive and fire. He gets it to trickle in. EDU, he missed the three. Rebound, Spicer put it up and off the glass and in. They are the definition of student athlete. Here's Jimmy Hall driving and scoring. Back in job by Ortiz. Toss it out far side. Kellen Thomas fires a three. Kaboom! Yeah, that's one he needed. Good to see Kellen. The front of the rim. Davis open and a soaring two hand slam jam as they beat the defense. Four players in double figures for Kent State. Kalik Spicer with a monster game. 17 points and seven rebounds for him. 13 for Jalal Cancer, including the two go-ahead free throws with seven seconds to go that provided the winning margin. Jimmy Hall finished with 11 points and 12 rebounds. Kellen Thomas had a nice game with 11 points, three assists as well. Defense was big in the second half as well for Kent State. Deion Edwin, who had nine points, added two assists and four big steals in the second half as well. Kent State was up 11 at one point. Northern Illinois' three-point shot made it a little close down the stretch. And a big block at the end moves Kent State back into the winning column. Kent State fell behind by one before the Jalal Cancer drive with seven seconds to go. Jalal will drive down the lane. He's fouled on a toss-up 50-50 blocker charge with 7.5 to go. The first is up. Tie game. Northern Illinois will again not have a timeout but has a chance at a walk-off victory. And here's Cancer's second free throw. It is good. And the lead is one for Kent State, and now seven seconds of defense away. Across the center line, Baker with four seconds. He creeps up with three. Down the lane, fires. Back iron, no. The game is over. With a record now of 16 and 8, 7 and 4 in Mid American Conference play, the Golden Flashes take another step toward that first round MAC tournament bye. They will be on the road this coming weekend with a second regular season matchup against Eastern Michigan. Tip time will be high noon from EMU's Convocation Center. Hope you've all enjoyed your Fat Tuesday and Mardi Gras. Kent State did its part in the celebration with a one-point win. For all of us on Golden Flashes TV, good night.